Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Doug Life here, back at it again with another bomb video. This video is an updated update for the Solo Retro Duplication Glitch, which is still working as of Monday, the 31st. As you're going to see here, all you're going to need is one friend in a different targeting mode, a Elegy RH8 in the back of your MOC, and some Elegy RH8s in other garages. As you're going to see here, Gonna go into my garage, or into my bunker. Sorry, go up to the black cir blue circle. I've already had this car in my MOC, as you see. I'm just gonna get my car ready. I am in a friend session. So I get the car position right for all you new subscribers out there. Please click that little bell next to my name. Always putting out videos and all the latest GTA glitches that are still working gonna see here I don't get it the first try uh, I'm not gonna edit any of it out just to show you that sometimes it isn't you know you don't always hit it the first try I'm gonna line the car up again so that when I get out I'm right in the blue circle as soon as you get the animation for grabbing the door handle which I did not get again then you're good okay as you're gonna see here I'm gonna possession myself where the blue circle was or just stay when you get out the car. As soon as I hit it, you'll see uh, another time I missed. I just want to let you guys know, you know, it's sometimes, you know, it does take a couple tries to get it. You know, you might not always get it on the first try. But, uh, yeah, thanks to everybody who uh, helped me reach 100 subs. Uh, greatly appreciated for all my subscribers out there. Uh, anyways, we're, as you're going to see here, once you keep missing, messing up, the dot card does face the other way. You're just going to hop back into the car and move the car back around. <clears throat> As you're going to see here. A big shout out to Brune Tango and Freight Train. What the fudge. Um, Dead Game and Live. Zazar909. As you're going to see here, I'm just checking to make sure the blue circle is still there. I'm going to go back. Stand where the blue circle was. And as soon as I hit B to collapse the menu, I'm going to press Y. Boom, see, and it doesn't work every try. Right, so, I'll try again. As soon as you see the animation of you pull it, grabbing for the, reaching for the door handle, like that, you're going to get a very long black loading screen. Then all you're going to want to do is go on to the Xbox dashboard. And you're going to want to find somebody on your friends list who's in a different targeting mode. And then you're going to want to join their game. It might take 9 or 10 tries for it even shows the details coming up. It usually does with this glitch, but this glitch is still working. Um, so for me, I usually become a secure serve associate. I, that way, you know, as you see there's the details. You're going to accept the first alert. You're going to decline the second. Then you're going to be in that black screen with the map. You just want to make sure you're got, your, your arrow is not up against the wall. Then you're going to click the Lester heist I think I have the prison break set up so it can be any of the Lester jobs that you get from him for like a setup or a heist it's gonna teleport me back to the my garage where my heist has started and then you and there you're gonna want to just when you get to the whiteboard you're just gonna want to hit B to quit gonna be invisible so then you're just gonna want to walk out the door and go towards your garage it's a little different I usually go in the first person view it's usually a little bit easier for some reason it looks like you're right high so you're gonna enter the garage as you see here and as soon as you get into the garage all you're gonna do is jump into the car that you want to duplicate and then you're going to press right trigger to drive outside so, as you see, the car does have a custom license plate on it. Just ignore that message up at the top of the screen. And as soon as you get outside, you're going to want to pull up your interaction menu. Request Mobile Operations Center. And that's going to teleport you down to the docks. <clears throat> as you see here, I'm just going to pull up my interaction menu again. I'm going to request Mobile Operations Center. And I'm also a secure serve associate, so I also 
start up my Securo serve and keep it going through the whole glitch and I request a buzzard so that way I can fly back to my garage. So, as you see here, you can just leave the Elegy Retro custom in the back of the trailer. As you see there, the plate now has changed. I'm just gonna leave the, I just leave it in the back of the trailer and as soon as I'm finished by putting it in here like so. So that it saves it, you only have to drive it in the one time. After that, I just exit the trailer, I return to storage, I hop in my buzzard, I fly back to my bunker to start it all again. And then all I do is request a elegy, regular elegy from my mechanic. When I bring that into my bunker, I go to replace it in the back of my MOC, and it just swaps the RH8 for the retro custom. So no need to have to drive it to no garage. Uh, no need to have to drive back to your bunker if you're all the way out in Polito Bay or anything like that. But yeah, great big shout out to all the people out there that have helped with this glitch. You know, to get it back up and running again. It's, uh, it's been patched a couple times. Big shout out to the founder, Broom Tango, and Freight Train for uh, showing me how easy this glitch really was to do. Anyways, uh, please click that little bell next to my name, like, and subscribe all my videos. Uh, thank you for all the subscribers for helping me get to 100 subs. I greatly, greatly appreciate it all. So, uh, yeah, anyways, for the next time, YouTube, peace out. I'll see you guys in the next video. On the clock, what you want? Some wheels? It's on the way. Hey, how can I help? Okay, okay, I'll get you out of trouble. No problem. <laughs> <laughs>